Now in Boston, the worst of the storm is expected to arrive later today. Forecasters say the snow could pile up at a rate of two to three inches per hour. Along the co with the uh, coast, they're going to have wind gusts of up to 75 miles per hour, and there is serious concern about flooding as well. So with the snowstorm that big, air traffic delays can be expected as people try to take flights and connect into major cities. News 13's Karen Wynn is streaming live at GSP International Airport in Greenville. Karen, what's the airport uh, saying at this point? Well, Victoria, they are really advising anyone traveling out of here to pack their patients along with everything else. And as you know, the Asheville Regional Airport does not have any direct flights to the snow zone right now. And so that means a lot of people from the mountains, they are making that long trip down here to GSP. Many, for many folks in the mountains, it's over an hour drive here. And so what the people here at this Ash at this airport are really advising is for travelers to call the airlines directly and just get details on the flight they're taking, what the status is, if it's been canceled, delayed, before you make the long trip down here to GSP. Get all the details, know what to expect, and that is really going to make traveling a lot easier. Now, there are flights here out of GSP that go to Philadelphia, Washington, D.C., New York. A lot of the ones that go on into D.C., you can connect to Boston, and so they are confirming that there are many flight delays, and folks just need to take their time. Of course, coming up tonight at 5, we're going to be talking with some of the travelers and find out how they're going to be dealing with this all. Live at the GSP International Airport, I'm Karen Wynn, News 13.